Hi guys, we are back with another video. Today we will be integrating Microsoft uh, login into our Bubble app. So using the Microsoft Graph a plugin. So let's just get straight to it. Now, first we're gonna do is like go to uh, my Azure dot Microsoft dot com. It's uh, portal dot Azure dot com. It's a Microsoft Azure portal. So you're gonna go here, and you're going to have to sign up into this account. I think I'm already signed in. That's why don't give me a sign up screen. So basically, you will be signing in into this dashboard, and. Uh, then this uh, uh, sign up process will also require you to enter a, a credit card so basically that's uh, temporary for like uh, one month so you can uh, for testing purposes you won't be charged anything for it but after that uh, it is pay, pay as you go and all the instructions are in the sign up process so when we are when you are on this portal then just go to uh, Azure Active, Di Active Directory. So this is just a default directory. Now you're gonna go is you're gonna do is like you will be registering your application here. So I'm just gonna register here. I'll be writing. Uh, just can write anything. So choice. Check this and. Uh, you can put in the redirect URI, go with web. Okay, let me just copy the redirect URI. So, there we go. Now, oh, just creating our application. So, application is created now what we need is the application id basically it's here so i'm just gonna copy this go to the microsoft craft uh, graph plugin you can put the application id over here and also over here now go back now what we will, we will be doing is going to get the secret client secret just create a new client secret from here Thing. Let's just say login. So copy this somewhere, write it down somewhere because this will be only shown to you once and then it will be hidden. So copy to clipboard, paste it here. Now, now we will have to set the API permissions. Like it's a scope basically for the APIs. So we're gonna have to add a permission to microsoft graph permissions check the email open id and prof profile and add these permissions now go back and uh, your bubble app so now here you can see i have added a like a simple icon Just go to the workflow section write down sign in with social network then go to microsoft graph 1.0 and then this is some text i'm showing like uh, will tell us that we are logged in now by clicking here we and i have in the microsoft graph get user data get users let me just do that for you okay go here like go get data from an external api go to um, let's just say we need microsoft graph get users and display name okay now let's test it out now this icon Now you come to this screen. You are giving your uh, this is the basically the permission scheme you are giving. So click yes, and we are back right here. Now it's 
getting data and there we go it got my data and we are logged in you can even check here like go to data and app there is a created user that's created just now hope you enjoyed it and thank you